we were aware that where pupils were using ICT, it tended to be in isolation. Um, but we were looking at ways that we could have them collaborating both in and outside the classroom. Um, so we're a, we've, as a school, we've got the Google Apps package, which we brought in just as email. But as part of that, then also gave us things like um, Google Docs, Google Sites, all of which provide an opportunity to collaborate. Uh, all the way through from year seven, all the way through to year 13, we're looking at different ways of having them collaborate uh, on this online platform. For our students, particularly our A-level students that you're, you're seeing today, it means that we ha the time we've got in class is quite restricted. So if we can model in class some of the behaviours that we'd like to see, those effective practices that they can then take away and do at home, it means there the time they put in at home is actually just more effic efficient and more effective as well. So as before, you might have one student go away and put the PowerPoint together for a group. Now, all the students are putting it together. And as a teacher, I can log on and see exactly who's made what contribution. So it means that actually when it comes to assessing group work, that's a little bit easier and the feedback can be much more targeted and specific. Um, it's made everyone aware that they need to play a part in whatever their team project is because that part we can now monitor. Um, it's also meant that because I can have a view on the process of them creating these things, my feedback can be much more timely. If I can, if they see them going wrong halfway through, I can steer them in the right direction rather than having to wait until the end and then giving them a comment then that they can go away and do again in the future. We've deliberately chosen things that are very easy to use because we know that our staff and our students are coming at this from different levels of, of expertise. I think the idea of collaboration online is something that there are enough tools out there that people can find a, a solution that works for them that's easy to roll out. So there's lots of stuff out there, um, most of it's cheap or free and it's there for schools just to go and play around with. I think an advantage of it is that it brings the, the class closer together. So if I'm at home and um, I missed a note on something or I didn't quite do enough notes on something, then it's all on, it's all on the web there for me. Yeah, it does make me feel more confident about my A-levels, I think, especially with revision when I'm panicking two nights before an exam. And then I'm looking um, online and I know I've got all my notes there for it and I'm a happy guy. I think this is going to continue to grow. Um, I think we're going to look then at kind of rolling out further. Uh, we'll do some more evaluation as the year goes on. Um, listen particularly to the, to the learners and find out what their feedback and how it could be even better for them.